Hey guys, Marsh Games here, and today I'm going to be showing you the easiest way to get Minecraft mods for any version of Minecraft, and we're starting right now. So what you're going to have to do is go on to your uh, browser, or I have internet, oh, I have, uh, what's it called? I forget what this thing's called. Microsoft Edge, my goodness. I used to use Chrome, but I keep thinking this is Internet Explorer. Anyway, so I'll leave three of these links in the description. Um, so, to get any mod for any version, you just go to the my files.minecraftforge.net and you can download any Forge. And Forge is what runs these mods. And right today I'm going to be getting the World Edit mod and the Lucky Blocks mod just for demonstration purposes. So, for I already have these for 1.11.2, so I'm going to go to 1.11, click on that, and then 1.11.2, we click on that. And you want to go to the recommended, uh, download recommended, not the latest, recommended is obviously recommended. <laughs> so go to the installer, click on installer, and it should bring you to this page. If it doesn't, just go back and do that again. And you're going to see up here, it says, please wait, and it'll wait. Sorry. Hope that's not copyrighted. Um, so it brings you to this page, bunch of ads, you press skip, and then it's going to download your file. So we're going to save this as our to our desktop. So click on desktop like this. There we go. And um, you can download any mod here. And the thing is, with the mods, I, I highly advise you having a VAS or some sort of um, antivirus program so you don't accidentally get something that has a threat on it. And so I have found safe ways to download these um, mods here. So we download a world edit. Um, world edit's very, very useful. I'm using it for my time lapse build, which is coming amazing. I'm hoping it's coming out uh, Saturday or Sunday. Today is Thursday. But anyways, um, I found this world edit. It's completely safe uh, at thecurseforge.com. If you just look up this, I just looked up, uh, wait, let's go back. Minecraft World Edit 1.11.2 Forge, and I clicked on the, f uh, the second link here of the overview of World Edit. So if you click download here, it's going to download the 1.12, and you don't want that. If Well, if you want that, you can just download it. We're going to go to Files here, and then you download the um, the version that you want. So 1.11 um, includes 1.11.2, so let's click this little download arrow right here. Click download, and it downloads it just directly and so we're going to save that again to our desktop so your forge is already here and I'll show you how to install your forge after we download a couple other mods okay it finished downloading now let's download lucky block mod I went to this uh, website found this completely safe I will paste this in the description also so minecraft 1.11.2 download from server 1 doesn't really matter and oh that's a nice ad uh... <laughs> we'll download this and it will Oh shoot! So it it might bring you to Roblox or some other weird website. If you, if it does, just go back to it and just download it again, and then click Save As, and then go to our desktop and make sure the desktop and click Save. There we go. And it's finished downloading. Now we can close out of this. Um, I'm actually gonna save this for a second. So we have our three files here that we need: Lucky Block mod, the World Edit mod, and Forge. So to get Forge, just double click Forge and uh, it will install right here, look at this so click on install client, click OK and it's going to install like this, I already have it installed so now I have two versions, it doesn't really matter if you have more than one forge installed so now we're done with that, um, I do have camera studio, this is for 1.8 that was a few tests I was doing for the time lapse, didn't really work out um, Another video should come out today. I will make a video called How to Make a Time Lapse Using One Account. Um, it's very, very easy. That's how I'm recording my time lapse for the city. Anyways, it's moving on. <coughs> um, to put the files into the folder that you need to have the actual mod, so if you click on Minecraft, let's run it here for a second. Okay. Um, there we go. So. Launch options, you want to go in here, add new, and then find at the very bottom right here the forge that you uh, have. And I'm, this is the one that I'm currently using, this is fine. 
So you would click on this, and but if we play on it, we don't have any mods. I do have a mod in the folder right now. That's just because I've been doing the time lapse. Anyways, sorry, I didn't tell you. You want to press um, the Windows key in the bottom uh, right. Uh, yeah, the, no, the bottom left hand area of your keyboard between Control and Alt. Hold that and press R, and it'll uh, pop up this little thing called Run. And then you want to type in here percent app data percent and it will bring you to uh, roaming and roaming you hear says dot minecraft if it's at the bottom um, just find it there mine's at the top doesn't really matter where it is so you go in here and if you don't have a mods folder like you've never downloaded mods before just right click make a new folder and call it mods all lowercase just like this and you go in here this is from something old I'm still using so you want to go in there and uh, you just drag your f um, your uh, mods into here. So double click on the lucky blocks here. And okay, so it's it's what we need. So I had to extract some files. Anyways, you put both of those in there. Um, we should actually extract those. So if it's in Win Win R A R Zip Archive, I'm uh, let's see if we need extract or not. I've never actually seen a mod like that. Like I've tried this and it didn't really work. So let's go into Minecraft and uh, run our forge that goes with our file and let's see if we can get the lucky blocks and the world edit to work. So if, if you've done everything correctly it should pop up with this called loading constructions and it'll start um, installing all your mods like I mean start um, running all your mods on Minecraft and uh, it, I, I'm not sure I know what this thing means like memory use but I don't think it's you really need it anyways it's downloading well, not really download. It's loading all your mods for us, and it might take a tiny bit of time. Shouldn't be that long. Almost there. Come on. There we go. Going full screen mode. Um, I hope you can see this. That should be better. I just changed my um OBS settings. Okay. Anyways, it's there. We go. It, it's correct. We don't have to strike any files. Six mod loaded. Six mods active. Though we only have two mods, but uh, there's four mods apparently to run everything. So. We got just the coder pack and forge mod loader forge stuff. Then we have lucky blocks here and world edit, which is awesome. And if you have a ton of mods, you can just search them up. I don't know why you would need that. But anyways, click done. I'm going to single player and make a new world. I'm not going to click on it because that will reveal the city that I am building. This is a parking garage I made as a very, very long time ago. I This is not in this part of the city. Anyways, I logged in and said lucky block. New version is available for Minecraft 4.12. Download it here. Don't need that. Anyways, so let's try this out. If our mod should be, so lucky blocks will be in the building blocks tab. Um, some mods will actually make multiple tabs. You can click on like over here area, and you click on this, and you have a whole new uh, setup like this over here. So let's clear my inventory here. Don't need that. So we get our lucky blocks. Let's get some very lucky blocks, unlucky blocks, and some regular lucky blocks. So let's place them down. Wait. Oh, don't we need like redstone torches? I haven't done this in years. Last time I played with lucky blocks. Oh man, I can't remember the time. Let's just. Oh, oh crap. That's just amazing. That's just totally amazing. So if you ever get this problem where you have too many mobs in your world, um, just do slash butcher, and this only works with world edit, and it kills all hostile mobs and your loaded render area. That's killed 74. Look, they, they spawn instantly. It is absolutely ridiculous. Anyways, let's play with some more lucky blocks here. Um, minus 80. Oh, that's going to be just a... We got a stick. Oh, nice. We got a uh, hero's axe. Wow. That's actually pretty good. So you can basically look up any mod you want. Let's say I want the, uh, man, what's a good Minecraft mod out there? There, Galactic Craft. Galactic Craft. Jeez, can't really spell today. Anyways, um, McDoodle 8. Yeah, McDoodle 8. No space, in space, nobody can hear you craft. Huh. Okay, um, I, I have played on this before, Galactic Craft. Um, it's for 1.7.10, I believe. Yeah, it is, I'm pretty sure. Start down. Oh, wait, that's an ad. Okay, so as you can see, um, if you download stuff, if this is the little tiny uh, box right here, I don't know if you can see this, it's very, very, very 
light contrast. Anyways, yeah, it's an ad. Don't click on that. We need to find where we can download this. Um, hmm. And I guess you can just look it up yourself if you want to do stuff. Anyways, I hope you found this video really, really useful and helpful. And if you want to download any mods, just, just go look on there. Make sure you have some sort of antivirus, like a VAS or something, so you don't s download some of the threat. Anyways, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the notification bell to get the latest uploads. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.